Welcome to Crypto's Gambler, nothing here is financial advice, let's get started. Imagine being able to buy $120 million worth of Bitcoin in one go. That's the staggering magnitude of the upcoming auction by the US government. To put this into perspective, it's not your everyday auction. We're talking about nearly 2,874 Bitcoins, a colossal amount seized from Ryan Ferres and Sean Bridges, individuals involved in illicit activities on the infamous Silk Road. To compare, in the past, the government's Bitcoin auctions involved substantial amounts, but this one? This one is unprecedented. And it's not just about the quantity. The value of Bitcoin has been relatively stable, hovering between $26,000 and $31,000. So, the sheer market value of these Bitcoins is enough to make any crypto enthusiast's heart race. But the story behind these Bitcoins adds an additional layer to the intrigue. Their origin traces back to the dark corridors of the Silk Road, confiscated from those who use the anonymity of the internet for illegal activities. This isn't just any auction. It's a historic event in the world of cryptocurrency. To understand the significance of this auction, we need to go back in time to the Silk Road case. Silk Road, for those who might not know, was a dark web marketplace, a digital den of iniquity, where anything from drugs to counterfeit money could be bought with Bitcoin. One of the key players in this illicit trade was a man named Ryan Ferris. Ferris was a prolific seller, dealing in Xanax, a prescription drug often abused for recreational purposes. His operation was so extensive, he received a total of 9,138 bitcoins for his illicit activities. But Ferris wasn't acting alone. Sean Bridges, a co-conspirator, was also involved in these transactions. Together they amassed a bitcoin fortune, all while operating under the radar on the Silk Road. However, their clandestine operations wouldn't last forever. In 2021, the US government swooped in, seizing nearly 2,874 bitcoins from the duo, with an additional 59 bitcoins belonging solely to Ferris. Ferris, in an attempt to move his bitcoin fortune out of the US, instructed his father to transfer the bitcoins to a third party. But the transactions didn't go unnoticed. Both Ferris and his father were sentenced to prison for money laundering conspiracy. The US government seizure didn't stop there. At one point, their holdings of Bitcoin linked to Silk Road reached a staggering 210,000 Bitcoins. The Silk Road case was a turning point in the use and perception of Bitcoin, leading us to where we are today. It served as a stark reminder that despite the anonymity of cryptocurrencies, they are not beyond the reach of the law. And now, the fruits of this dark web marketplace are poised to go under the hammer in a historic auction, marking yet another milestone in the tumultuous journey of Bitcoin. What happens when the government sells $120 million worth of Bitcoin? A question that's been on the minds of many, especially those invested in the world of cryptocurrency. In the past, we've seen large amounts of Bitcoin being sold, and the impact on the price has been significant. For instance, the US government once owned over 200,000 Bitcoins, with an estimated worth of $5.5 billion. These were seized from cybercriminals, and their sales through auctions had a noticeable effect on Bitcoin's price. Now, with the upcoming auction of nearly 2,874 Bitcoins seized from Silk Road operators, we could be looking at yet another substantial impact on the market. The sheer volume of Bitcoin being sold could potentially result in a price drop. However, it's important to note that the cryptocurrency market is notoriously volatile and unpredictable. Factors such as trading volumes, market sentiment and global economic conditions can all play a part in how the market reacts to such a large-scale sale. While we can't predict the future, this auction could make waves in the cryptocurrency world. So, what does all this mean? Well, let's take a moment to recap. We've explored the notorious Silk Road case and how it led to the seizure of a massive amount of Bitcoin. This Bitcoin, now in the hands of the US government, is set to go under the hammer in an auction that's already making headlines. The potential impacts of this auction are quite significant. Will it affect the price of Bitcoin? Only time will tell. The world of cryptocurrency is always full of surprises, and this auction is no exception. Please like and subscribe for more videos like this. If there's any crypto you want me to talk about or anything crypto related, comment below. Please beware of low-life scammers in the comment sections either impersonating me or anyone and trying to get you off the YouTube platform for anything. Have a great day.